My name's John Cheney, and I'm the founder and CEO of Workbook CRM. So we implement literally hundreds of marketing solutions for organizations. And actually what I'd like to do is give you some examples, of, frankly, some pretty poor marketing that we've seen over the years. So often when we engage with clients, they don't have a CRM platform in place and they may just have a marketing tool, very commonly an email marketing platform. Now we've been to several organizations where the marketing team feel they're delivering a really good job, they're doing lots of email marketing, getting lots of form conversions, people filling out forms on their website, their Google Analytics tell them they're doing a great job. But actually, those form conversions were going into emails, they were going into sales teams, they really weren't getting followed up. And because they weren't measuring the number of leads that were going into the sales team, they weren't really able to assess how effective their marketing was. And in one particular customer case, it was actually worse than that. The, the sales guy receiving the emails had left. And the leads were just going into an empty inbox, not really being measured by anybody. So the other sales team members didn't really notice because they didn't get that many leads. So when we arrived and allowed them to start measuring the effectiveness of their lead flow and seeing on a daily basis how many leads were coming through the system, they could see if, if marketing was generating more or less leads on a weekly basis. And if marketing was going down, how did they help and what did they need to change to improve the lead flow in the business? As one example of where poor measurement of marketing meant that even though they were generating leads at that particular customer, the leads weren't even reaching the sales team. Another good example comes back to email marketing. We had another client of ours that um, opened a European office and started doing email marketing in a new country. But actually, they made the mistake of sending all their email communications out from the UK without any real change in the content they were sending. And quite quickly, their emails were getting blacklisted. They weren't really checking their delivery rates. They didn't have any tools in place to assess how effective the email delivery would be. And they were spending a lot of money creating content that nobody ever saw because it never reached anybody's inbox. So it isn't just about measuring the conversion rates of your marketing execution. You really need to look at all aspects of the marketing funnel to work out whether your outreach is working, whether it's really reaching the people you want it to reach, whether there are problems with the technology or the systems that you're using that mean you're not getting the results you'd expect.